Hello everybody, it's Dave Robles with Think Real Estate, bringing you episode 31 of the great California Corona Staycation Show. So when we began this show 30 day, 31 days ago now, uh, it was the day that uh, California went into stay at home mode for one month. And we we're expecting, let's do it for the month that we're at stay at home. Uh, and then they extended it till May 15th. So we've done our month and we're not done yet, but we are going to change it from an everyday show to a Monday, Wednesday, Friday event for your uh, enjoyment. Uh, so that's what to expect going on. Every Monday is going to be a little market update uh, to, to kind of let you know what's been going on in the previous week. Um, and let's start with that here today, okay? We're going to go take a deeper dive with stats in four different areas. And we're going to start with Glendale. Uh, in Glendale, in the last week, seven days, there have been nine new listings to come on the market. And that is five more than the previous week, okay? Um, he also here in Glendale, there were zero properties that went under contract. And that means zero properties that got accepted offers on them in the last seven days. That is down two from the previous week. Also here in Glendale, there were three properties that went pending. Now that means that they're in escrow and the buyers have removed all their contingencies and they're probably getting ready to close. So that's good news. Three went into pending, and that is two more than the previous week. And in the past seven days, there have been three closed sales in Glendale, and that is down one from the previous week. Okay, let's look at Pasadena for our Pasadena friends. This week, there were 17 new listings in Pasadena in the last seven days, and that is up nine from the previous week. Under contract, brand new kind of under contract properties, six new under contract properties in Pasadena, that's down three, okay? And in pending properties that are getting ready to close, three of those brand new uh, in Pasadena, and that is up two from the previous week. And in sold properties, 10. 10 houses closed escrow last week, and that is up one from the, uh, from the week before. Neela, Northeast Los Angeles, the Hipster Corridor. 11 new listings uh, to hit the market in Neela. That's down 10. That's quite a bit. Down 10 from the week before. Active under contract, those new contracts, those new escrows. There are six of them, and that's down three from the week before. Pending, one, and that is down four from the week before. And sold, there are 15 sold properties in Neela last week, and that's down 11 from the week before. Let's look at the whole city. City of Los Angeles, new listings, 104 new listings. That is 13 more than the week before. Los Angeles City under contract. There were 40. 40 new under contract properties. And that's up 14 from the week before. And looking at the pending properties in the city of Los Angeles, 22. 22 properties have uh, been marked pending. It means they're getting ready to close. And that's up three from last year. And finally... Last week, 72 houses in the city of Los Angeles closed escrow, and that's only down two from the city uh, from the week, week before. Uh, there you go. That's a little market update for you. You know, a lot, of, a lot of stuff there. Hard to find common denominators, commonalities amongst all these numbers. A bit all over the place, but it does show us things are moving. Houses are, are actually selling, um, and we're going to take a look at that every Monday. I hope you're well. If you have questions about a specific area, 
let me know. I'd be happy to, uh, to ping you uh, uh, information about a specific area that you're interested in. Okay, take care. Bye-bye.